Okay, everyone, it is now time for my entire Jurassic Park, well, slash world, my Jurassic World line by Mattel. But there's like a couple other little smaller stuff in there. It's all in that tote, except the super colossal T Rex and the ones I'm actually going to paint. I painted some of these like bright ass colors. I, I got one of them. Like, I just wanted to paint them. Um, this stupid little spoiler. I'm trying to get my, I got another extreme job in Rex. In these colors, I'm going to try to do it sometime tomorrow or Saturday. No guarantee. So, um, I got my Sherbert. And we're going to, um, hopefully I can try to eat this without the Marco eating it too. Mm-mm. Dan, a big bite. This is my, like, it's one of my very first Jurassic by Mattel. I actually got that little battle damage, um, with the little minifigure kit. It was, like, ten bucks. And this is already, like, fifty-something. My grandma, she got it for me. And... Got it's the beauty. I had to redo the eye. I think I did a really good job on it. Now y'all wanna see what the fuck's in that tote. Now I wanna show you like this last one. It's the little the new little chrome spinosaurus or metallic one. You can just put him right right there. We're just gonna put him right in between his toes. Now, you really want to see what the hell is in there. You probably already know. Full of my dinosaurs. I got a couple, like, repaints, like, big figures, and I really need to get to it. Like, come on, plus, you have to get this. You, I've been wanting to do this video for the people to show off how cool I am with my Jurassic World. Alright. Um, I got quite a bit of shit. I got some new shit, too. Um, let's just... Grab one, um, sound strike pteranodon, so, I'm not gonna do, like, do, oh, do a full review, there's no stickers on any of these, see? There's two little buttons there, and then, so we're just gonna put the pterosaur right there, ooh, classic, All right, so let me fix, let me fix the feet on her. It's one of my favorites. Remember this one, Marco? Yeah, Marco don't like this one. So this is my one of my favorites. It's my um actually one of my first ones. You can see destroying the Varun Damas Rex. It's the 2019 version. So I have a card for it. So button right there. No sticker on like I said, there's no sticker on any of these. Uh, let's just grab, um, something, like, the, one of my, a um, my action attack, Sukumimus. Now, I won't be able to really get this from the stand. I think this one's kind of broke, because usually it'll kind of, um, close its mouth, but it'll kind of hang open like that. It's for as long as I hold the button, the mouse hangs open. So, um, yeah, we're just going to lean some of these. Um, um, okay. I had to get a replacement for this one, but I, no scratching, Marco. This is the Battle Damage Albertosaurus. I got this one the other day. I glued the Battle Damage on mine, and I still have not yet to file that stupid knot off. So, yeah, I have a painted version. That's my new one. Um, I'm just going to grab the ones that really aren't the greatest, like, no really, really needs to know much about them. Um, I probably haven't seen this one too much on my channel, my, um, Savage Strikes Derakosaurus, so you just, all you do 
If you, it can be, I mean, they could put this in a primal attack form. Uh, yeah, so you just put the tail up and down. There's no special buttons and crap. Um, there's another action attack. It's old. It's actually before I really got hardcore collecting. It's really old, and I saw one of the legs. Uh, in my room, and I was like, where's the body? And I saw another leg, so I glued... It was the two front legs. And the two back ones, no sticker. So basically what you do is, there's a button right there, and it just... Will tail whack, it's pretty neat. Okay, this is a really nice one, I really like this one. This one, I haven't... I got this one, um, uh, for my birthday. Sorry, grab and grow in the raptor. That sounds like another roar, roar. I don't really remember. Ah, uh, I think this one, I'm, I think it's just mine. Oh. Well, push it really hard. It can kind of stay shut. You can just open it like that. It's alright, Marco. Oh, here's the... No scratching, I know. This is my real field Mosasaurus. I... This tote is freaking huge. I probably won't even get all of it in one video. I'll try to cram it all in one video. There's really no special mechanics on this one. No buttons. It all has like a real feel. Um, yeah, but something stupid on mine. It's very old. See, we, you, you want to have the mouth shut. It just hang, hangs up a little bit. There's a really easy fix like it's really easy you just um take the little bit of plastic that's underneath this i mean if you want to like heat it up with a dryer for a couple seconds it'll work but there's a tiny little bit of plastic like right under the right under the jaw you don't even have to get the whole thing out you like a, a part of it and you'll stay shut it won't even open i don't really like the pose on it Okay, this is a, this is a classic. Um, it's a Rorivore Ceratosaurus. Um, come on, fix the legs. I know some of these have like, tiny ass feet, so it's a Rorivore. I think I just said that before, and it, this one. Something weird about that one. The mouth stays shut, and then you hit the button, and then it opens. So about every other one, I'm going to eat some more sherbet. Okay, here's one of my new ones. Just an attack pack Dilophosaurus. I got it from a third-party seller. And it's a lot cheaper looking than I expected it. And the mouse on this one, it does not articulate. See, it doesn't. And did the end come with a goddamn spitting piece. Which is okay, I guess. I mean, it, it's fine. It's an attack pack. So, um... I just got this one today. I took all my stickers off of them. I only save a couple of them. They're somewhere over there. So, this is, like, new. It stands. This is my, um... My attack pack Velociraptor Blue. I got two of them now. One of them has a really bad eye. Because I was glossing it. And my aunt brought home the wrong stuff. She brought home the top base coat. Like top coat. And base coat. So all I did. I was wanting to paint the claws. But I really didn't. I changed my mind. But what I did want to do is extend the stripe a little bit. It's like, it's, this side it looks great. This side out so much I kind of messed up. Just like getting yellow and crap. I really need to hurry the hell up. This one's broke. Something in the speakers. This thing will just stop. See, I wish you listen again. 
Hopefully I can get another one tomorrow. Because me and my aunt are going out sometimes. Okay, this is my baby right here. It's like my it's like my prized possession. Freaking legacy Spinosaurus. Yes, I really like it. There's an entire video on YouTube about this. Okay. In the story, here's another one of my new ones. That's one of my new ones. That's the new one I got the attack pack. The morphinon we got from a third party seller. We got that one from a third party seller. The blue actually came in earlier this day. It's like, um, it's 10 after 10 Eastern time zone PM. So it's, I really like this one. I don't know. I like the colors. I like the gray and the red. Alright, no stickers, because this one actually didn't come with a sticker. That's kind of sad. I mean, at least I'm not the only one that does this creepy crap with the stickers. I eat this sherbet before it melts. This is, this, this one still works. It's old. I really like that one. There's no sudden freaking stopping on that one. I can show off all eight of the Roar Four. I got the last Roar Four I needed, which is the Baryonyx. No scratching. Yes, beef jerky on his side. Come on, show us just, you see that little bit of black? It, it was huge was last week. This is the, the Ankylosaurus. When the, um, shipper sent it to us, um, I'm assuming that he or she has smaller children. This one was fine, but it came with an an another one of those. It's up there. It, it didn't work, but this one works as you just heard it. So, and something about the legs. It's a little loose, I guess. I'm just freaking glad I got it. I'm, I'm glad this is the one that worked. And some of them, they'll just say used. One of them doesn't work. They don't even specify. Because they just want you to... Alright, motion alert. Um, this is one of my really favorites. My action attack contours. Uh, I think the Sukumaima said the same thing as this. I don't know what happened with it, but somehow I think it might have got stepped on. So yeah, this is on my. I say I have two of these. My aunt was. We're trying to order that one, but it, um, it came later. Well, we didn't mean to. We thought we were ordering this one, but it gave us. It gave us another one of these. Yeah, I don't know what I think something wrong with it. Ah, yes, it works smooth. I'm going to try to do some of the really homemade sand that you can make with the little sculpty clay in the, in the wire. Okay, this one I actually did a little bit of work on last week. It's uh, the Bull T Rex. Uh, because when you first get it, it's like it's the only Bull T Rex they have. And it doesn't really even look like it as much. It's the whole tail, it was just gray. It was just green. But I actually tried and attempted to paint more of the little stripes and rings. I didn't really do a good job. I went all the way down to the friggin' tip of the tail, like, right there. Um, and the feet on this one, it is really loose. Uh, my little trick is, but you keep me, but I'm not really sure if it's, if it's a good trick. You put clear nail polish around the the ankles or the or the part that that you don't want to spin or the the rotate bad. 
and it kind of stops it a little bit, but you gotta let it sit for a bit. Like, my guess is about half hour. And another Ceratosaurus. Same thing as that one. Um, Jesus, guys. We didn't even get... But we got all the little suckers to get out. And this is actually a pecky rhinosaurus, not a freaking Sinoceratops. See? Sinoceratops would have a sick ass horn right there, but they just they didn't really do it right. Still waiting for the new one to come out, the new Sinoceratops. You haven't seen it? It's freaking awesome. The soundtrack like this one, the Cryosaurus. The mouse does move. It's like a, um, I call it a manually open one. I'm sure you saw it. I'm gonna get this last bite in me. Okay, we're back. This is another Roar it's an Ankylosaurus. It's the other one. Not that one, it's like the, uh, the, the more uglier colors that might have been more accurate. Like they just stop painting on the tail, they don't look, look that's just ugly. Same little gimmick on the other one. Uh, I'm just gonna get a handful of small ones. However many I can get, like really tiny, like the smaller figures. I'm just, I'm just looking at me dog. Okay, I got whatever I got. Got a little Spinosaurus. At, uh, mini action dinosaur. I'm just gonna let it sit there. Oh, cool. This is the Primal Attack Rant for Rinkus Attack Pack. It's kind of cool, but I wouldn't open it all the way far. It looks like that, but it kind of stop lets you know, hey, asshole, yeah, so stop right there. I think the color of that one is much nicer. I got a couple more minis. I got a Sticky Mohawk. And I got a Dimorphodon. It's actually the one you get in the blind bags. It's similar to that one, but instead of the the red being in on the on the inner side of the wing, or the bottom part, it's actually on the top. So yeah, I'm just gonna put all the mini ones. You know what? I'll be I'll be kind of cool. We can just feed it to to my to my Tyrannosaurus. Betcha she's hungry. That's all you do. You do the little hatch right there. That you get all your stuff out with. I actually had to paint the teeth as well. I painted more battle damage than I painted the back of it. Like, the shading is horrible, but I made it work. I'm just gonna see these suckers too. Rexy. I'm kind of slow, you guys. Alright, we got another Spinosaurus. It's like the only other good one. Let's see. Battle damage one. This one is nice because you could, um, let me do some of these. Um, what you do is you just rip off the skin. And you rip off the bones. It, this is weird. It's like a tiny part of the sail right there. Yeah, I'm um, not. Okay, guarantee, you know what? I should put on my Jurassic Park shirt, which I. I was trying to do, no, I didn't do it. Too. Oh well. This is um, I don't know what about it, but I kind of like these Dino Drivers one. These kind of these Triceratops. This one, this one in general, I like it. They don't make noise, and this one just has a little tail whip. They really need to make like a an Apatosaurus or a Diplodocus, which they'll never make. They got mini figures of both of them, but they're really not as popular as the Brachiosaurus. And I just got an old mercenary. Hell, oh, we'll see him too. Uh, I'm just gonna get a couple more little ones. I got a bunch of got. I got the baby Rex, which I actually painted more striping on it, which didn't look great on it. I mean, 
The color is all right. Yeah. It sounds like right. That was the last one of them. These are just mine. Put that next to the buck. There's the other rant for Rankus. I really want to just get this done. I gotta be in bed by midnight. Cause Kimmy will be mad if he if I'm not in bed by midnight. Ah, uh, there's Vosrak Delta. I actually have. I bought another one, and um, I bought two of them. One of them I'm working on, but I um, I really don't know where that went to. I got a little Draco Rex, one of the attack packs. It's the 2019 one. It's one of the best ones from the whole year. And that one. And I have one of those new Primal Attack Savage Strikes. That Charlie. Oh, that one's just. Alright, we got scratching. I have the Thor Pelta and the new blue. The jumping blue, which it's it's very special. Yeah, I, I bet you none of you have actually noticed, but when I find it in the box, uh, I'll show you. This is the soundtrack of Mount the Source. I did a video on this one. I love my Marco. He's a good boy. Yes, he is. Yes, I love him. This is an um, Aurora Vort, so make sure you can't the Saurus. There, they got two of them. I got both of them. One of them, the one I did. The red one, which is right here, the circuit broke. And I just never really gotten a chance to get the batteries back in. Or, well, if the circuits break, you can't fix it because there's really no screw holes. Because they don't let you like take that off. It's like once it's broke, they expect you to buy another one. And you know how Mattel.com is. They they don't let you buy off their website. They just say, oh, here's the recommended. Oh, you know what? I lied. So here are some stores that have it. And they ain't got it. It's stupid. Okay, I got another Sticky Bell Lock Mini. I actually put some blood on it. On his horns. I just took some, like, red paint. Remember, we gotta feed it to the racks. Come on, damn it. Oh, cool. We got, um, uh, Biodynamics Pachycephalosaurus. I mean, I actually glued it shut, and you can kind of tell where I painted over the knot. Just trying to hide it a little bit, just to make it feel nicer for me. Okay, we got both of these in one little pickup. The Battle of Big Rock Allosaurus. I like the Rover one better. So it just looks different. I mean, and this one doesn't really stand that well. Well, I'm just leaning it. And I got the Nasuto Ceratops, which is oversized. Because this is the Rover Triceratops. Let me fix it. And that's the Nasudoceratops. If I... It's... It looks oversized. It's taller. Not just at the fur, but at the hips and wherever. This one, and, um... It could have made it a little smaller. Um... Sometimes it'll get a little blurry like that. I don't mean that it gets blurry. Uh, it's just like, I really have no exclamation for it. Uh, I'll just put it right there. Oh, and I have some flattened coins. Okay, I'll just put a, grab whatever ones I can fit in my hand. Nice, we got one of my new ones. Oh, well. This is my, one of my new ones. I just got it today. I had to get this sucker off Amazon. Well, we had to get it off Amazon. Uh, I'm just going to put them right there. 
We got the Savage Strike Ta Ta Tapajara. It's, tw it's 2019 one. I, um, I got the card for it. I probably have a video. It's just to me going over my pointless cards. Probably going to be collector's items. Okay, this is my battle image one. I actually glued it first, but then I wanted to um, get rid of the... I don't want to save it. Yes. See, it looks horrible. I'm just going to leave it out like that. I'm just going to put it like right there. We got, I got three of the same one. We just fed one to the Rex. Now there's two. And here's some more minis. There's a Brachiosaurus, a uh, Metriacanthosaurus, a um, Pesuchus, that's the old one. And Pteranodon. Wait, yeah, that's a Pteranodon. I said it stupid. Um, really don't mean to waste y'all's time. Ah, uh, starting a little tired. I want more sherbet, like, for i to get more out of this video. Here, get the hoe down there. This is just, this is my Savage Strike Sorapelta. All you do, it's kind of pointless. Well, oh, you're supposed to get these little spikes to move. I think the Akentrosaurus would actually make more sense. Yeah, like you can play with it at the spikes, and then you can um get the tail to like whack, and you you can do it if you just try. I'm just gonna get more. Got um. Okay, this is the one. This this blue actually has the little hornlets like right there. Here's the attack pack, and it doesn't have the little horns. And, um, this one. Well, the, I think it's all the, all of the jumping blues. Um. Yeah, um, that one's the one with the little horns. It looks like the little part of the stall that makes it. It has the little, little bumps right there in front of the eye, and this one doesn't. And all the other blues, they don't have the little bumps. That's kind of special. I uh, just got a little Perseratosaurus. Um, I think it's the Dino Rivals. Just a little, a little attack pack. And one of my bow damage Pteranodons. I actually put a little bit of red paint um, around it. And I glued them shut. Fired off his knob. Make it look better. Get rid of some of that bubble wrap. Oh, I'm just going to randomly put these. Nice. This is my one of my very first. Um, it's the Extreme Shopping T-Rex. And the other day, well, like somehow last week, well, the tongue came off and I glued it back on and now it just wants to stay open. Ah, uh, it's kind of nice, but it does close, it just does that, and it'll stay closed. And you can just probably open like that, it's kind of nice too. But seriously, I wouldn't just do it just for that. I would at least have a duplicate, just in case if the one doesn't work. You have, like, the other one. I'll get her, like, the roaring crap. No, oh, I just want these. I don't care if they're gleaming. I just want it to look good. We ain't gonna get the Brachiosaurus anytime soon. This is my one of my concavenators. I got both of them. And the little how you do the tail is you just push the little thing out like that. Looks like a volcano kind of. Um, I got a lot in here. I got Owen's bike. It's missing the shotgun. I don't know where that was. It's somewhere in my mom's house. In my room at my mom's house. Um, here's Owen. Um, 
is um the Parasaurolosis Dino Rivals, the um the dual attack. I think that's what they're called. And this is a really fun one. It's the um the ma the massive biter Sarcosuchus, it's primal attack. So really it would not just death roll in real life like like most crocodiles, modern and past. Well, you're just supposed to do it like that. Well, this jumpy blue just wants to wobble over a little bit. I really want to get this video done. Ah, uh, we're nowhere near. This is just another extreme time in T-Rex. The one for this year. This one's just hard to open. Or it's just stupid. You just gotta put some WD-40 in the butt, like inside the button, and it'll just loosen it up pretty well. Come on, nice. There's a bite and fight T-Rex. It's just something like this. I mean, it'd be cool if it, went, if it did it on both sides. And then there's the tail. It's just stupid how it does a little tail whack. I'm gonna put it right there. And I gotta fix the feet on this. I think it is. No. That's good. This is one of my favorites. The, um, Allosaurus Roar Horror. I'm just gonna put it right there. It's very inaccurate. I know it's just a juvenile in the movie, but even that battle big rock, it's fully grown it's and that's right there. It's tiny. This is the um attack pack sticky. The sticky Mohawk. Alright, uh hopefully I can get like all this in one video. I'm just gonna start going through it. There is the Savage Strike Plesiosaurus. And the mouth does open, it's just manually. This is one of my, um, battle damage, battle, uh, bear axe breakout. I just painted over the old scars, well, and then I put new ones on. I got some on the eye. I gored it up. There's like, scratches on the inside of the leg. Oh, this mini cigarette painted blood around his horns. Oh. So, I'm gonna leave this one out. It's too big.